Hey guys, welcome back. We're going to build a brain tumor convolutional neural network. Download this data set. Here are the four classes, guys. Geloma, meninoma, no tumor, and pituitary. So it's three different types of tumors and then a healthy brain. There's a training and a test folder. Let's get started. Un unzip it after you import it into here. Okay, and then read those file paths after you import these libraries. And then um, import this library right here. And then horizontal flip equals true for data augmentation for both taste, test, and train uh, generator. And read the file paths. Target shape is 384, 384. Class mode categorical. Batch size for training is 24. Batch size for test is 14. There's four classes, as you can see it detected. Okay. Dense 4, activation equals ReLU. You do Dense 4 because there's four classes. 384, 384 from the target shape. And then 3. 128 all the way down to 8. Pass these kernel size and pool size parameters. Max pooling is used for to prevent overfitting. Dense 4 after flatten, activation equals softmax. If it were binary, we would do sigmoid. Optimizer atom, categorical cross entropy, and categorical accuracy. CNN summary. And if you guys want to perfect this, put this at 15 to 18 epochs. It could do even better, even though it got all the predictions correct. Okay, fit, and here we go. Okay, as you can see, the last epoch, however, it could do even better. 91% categorical and validation 87%. Now guys, be aware at 15 to 18, it could do even better for the training and test loss as well as the metrics across the board. Okay, import CV2 in these libraries, read it. And 384 from the target and input shape, remember? Okay, read the file, your test, get these guys from the internet. We want to predict on new images. Okay, CV2 IM color. Resize the arrays. Reshape negative one and three after the image size. Return it. Predict prepare. And here we go. It predicted the image. Those are the sequences of arrays since there's four classes. MP argmax function to compute zero. Okay, guys, let's go. Zero, because it's a galoma. Okay. Now we're going to do healthy brain, which is three, no tumor. Same thing. And zero, one, and two. You see? Class label two, correct. Meningoma, same thing. Omi, this is one, class label one, because it's the order of the files. One. Okay, we're going to do the same thing for pituitary. That's class label three, three. And then you guys can save it and then dot H5, name it whatever you want to save the model. Now, guys, one more thing. Um, next time we're going to get back on AWS with SageMaker. Now, we're either going to, I'm either going to upgrade to a GPU instance on the, on the SageMaker account I've used the last videos for and deploy image classifier or object detection algorithm or i'm going to do bert model or um, later on down the line i'm going to do a bert pipeline before we get to google cloud again and then um or i just might do a pipeline after it's approved like i've done in the other three videos how to get these t different types of models approved Omi, we might add one more page, uh, one more Python file of code and deploy it. I haven't decided yet. And deploy it, make a quick prediction with test data. And if I do do that, you guys will have to stay tuned to find out which type of algorithm that we've covered, one of the three that I'm going to use. Okay, guys. Um, Stay tuned. Be sure to hit like and subscribe. Thank you.